Let's go, nine. Let's go. Three. Big tester at the back. Superbly contested. Apelele Fassi. Three test matches for South Africa for Apelele Fassi. The counter rack is good, but the Sharks do exceptionally well as Fenter comes through. Fenter powers over. James Fenter. The magical touch from Lionel Crinia. The finish from Fenter. And Klaassen. That's good counter. Ah, oh, the shots. Senge is giving away. Number seven. Must come from the back on the side. Wasn't Yao Ping there. He would have been yeah, away under the, the sticks if it was allowed to play on. So right at the back of the line out is judged to go too early in from the side. Time is off, we're waiting for a ball. There's a strike from uh, De Pia. And flags are up. Pumas, one point lead. Farsi coming back in field. Stefan, that was on the ball. The meta could be in trouble for a high tackle. There was the, was the head clash. Kutam Kunu stays down. De Pia. I heard the referee say that he thought it, the tackle was on the ball, but we'll have another look at it now as there is an injury. Okay, that's on the wrong mark. No, that's on the wrong mark. Yeah. Yes, Christopher, so he's always upright. Um, there's direct contact to it, clear line of sight. Okay, did you have a look at the visuals? Yeah, sure. We couldn't find any mitigation, direct air contact. So, you know the answer to that one. Yep. Pumas will finish this round 10 clash with 14 men. And Jabulo Kumete. In the trenches go the Pumas. So, looks like the only one from an offside position. He's never onside. To be at. First few points of the second half go to the Pumas. Scramble defensively. And for Ree. Try on the side now for the Pumas and Senge. Big hit on the winger. The drop goal nowhere through. Genus De Beer. Advantage is over. That's nothing more than a penalty, right, Stefan? Takes the Pumas Teddy to 15. Ruval Panamera has come on for, for Shea. For the Pumas. And Hugo brings it down for the visiting Sharks. They carry, but it's held up again. Held up. Held up. Very good defense there from September. Hold on. Stands up. Okay, Stefan, you see the actions of number five? Let me deal with the grounding first, please. Okay. So that's clearly held up. <laughs> Very obviously held up. Yep. Did that collapse again? Yeah, it was number five. I disagree with this decision. Cynical collapse of them all? Yeah. He's gone for an TMO yeah, decision yeah. on a try and has seen something else <laughs> and then given a yellow card. Hold on, Lionel, I just want them to be ready. Not on. Okay, so that's a cynical collapse by number five. So down to 13 men, the Pumas yellow card to Shane Kirkwood. In the front. Ah, the Sharks. If they show patience, they should cross over. 
as Dylan Richardson joins and there's the try. Second try of the match. There we go. So Dan Yersa got it down. Going for the driving wall. When the moment breaks. Corey keeps it up, looking to set up Nines! another driving wall. Step and go, Stamman. The locals on their feet celebrating with the Pumas. Only 12 points, he needs to score twice. Costa. David and Richardson. Straight into Lungisa. Left it. Could that be down? Try time. He had no right to score that, but he's done so. Dylan Richardson, the Scotland international, gets the Sharks third try. Andre Jakobs, same side they go. Richardson, Richardson, goes to ground, makes it available. The experienced Henkel Fenter. No end, no end, no end. Corner for Rio Slow. There's the try. The kick to win it. And what a comeback. Salsi Sharks away from home they did the impossible last weekend in Pretoria with the kick to come Naval de Fleurs the second kick of the match in the 81st minute Bombela Stadium the locals are letting know what they feel it doesn't matter the Sharks victorious in Bombela with the bonus point what a comeback 